Uh, there we go. A shrub. A shrub. Now, what do we have here? What's this? Another beehive. Do you think we should be able to collect honey from a beehive at some point? I just need to figure out how. Oh, what do we have here? What? What's all of this? Like, seriously. Where's all of this stuff coming from? Bamboo? An apple? What's this? The bamboo sapling. Okay, we will plant the bamboo sapling here and here and here for future growth. Of course, have we not picked them up, uh, they would have also continued to grow. But this is not just a case that there's only one type of bamboo, there's just so much variety even. You know, so we've got this type of bamboo here, then you've got your uh, Timor black bamboo. Uh, you've got... What's this? More bamboo? And you've got tropical blue bamboo. I don't know. This... I think it's pretty cool. Ooh. Wrong button. I have just gone in a really convoluted way and I'm essentially heading back to the area that I was running away from earlier. Now, let's see. Still okay ish for food. The steak definitely seems to be what nourishes us most at the moment. Get another beehive here. We do have one uh, queen bee in the uh, uh, in our hut in our shelter. But obviously, needless to say, we don't have anything to actually do with the queen bee for the time being. There was that huge mountain. What's up there? Okay, nothing. It's, uh, that was the oil sands, quicksand, something to avoid. Ah, okay, there's a river of some kind down there. Some more quicksands. Apparently the uh, desert is meant to have... Ouch. Uh, a number of ruins and clearly also some really impressive looking caverns. Which we are just going to head down quickly. I'm sure we'll find our way back. Where's that mine over there? Uh, you yeah, know, the um, desert biome is meant to have a uh, apparently a larger concentration of ruins and temples. I have absolutely no idea if that is accurate or not. Uh, it's just what I've been told. But I have yet to find a single temple. Hmm, interesting. There's another lava field over there. Water is pulling us downstream quite heavily. And what's this? Is this oil? Might very well be oil. Not something we want to uh, swim in, to say the least. 
Sun's going down, moon's coming up. And more sugar cane over here. And that seems to be quite a large... Uh, actually, I'm not even sure if that is lava. Or, no, I don't think that is lava. I think it's just a new... Uh, or a different biome, rather. Looks a bit canyonish. More big cats. Ah, I just walked straight into that one, didn't I? There we go. Uh, yeah, leave that quicksand here somewhere. Do you want to connect these though? I think they are quite nice. They don't add too much light, but that looks like an end. Yep. Tree ends. What kind of woods do we have here? Jungle woods. Okay. Yeah, okay, that looks like a mountain range. Which is part of the brushland. Oh no, I'm in the brushland right now. Oh, it still considers me to be in the river. Uh, yeah, we will just leave that sand here. There we go. What's this? Salt ore. Uh, cave. Red Rock Mountains is where we are. And it is a very fitting description. realize it is very or most likely very dark for the recording so I'm not going to delve too far into that but what do we have down here uh, another deep cavern of some kind the rhyolite looks quite nice interesting. Some really bizarre looking trees over there. And I have no idea what that is, but it does not look healthy. Hardened clay is here. Okay, good stuff. In case we want to do some uh, brickwork later on, we've got a huge supply of clay. Bloody cacti. Yeah, tell me about it now. I also stepped into it. I think this must be an oil field that, uh, although it's not hurting the animals, I don't really want to attempt to step into it. I was hoping to find more 
Um, villages, though. Just gonna eat some carrots quickly while we're here. This jumping is increasing our hunger rate as well. Ah, that's nice. Piggy with the flag. Um, which obviously does mean that we need to pay more attention to what our food consumption is like. Let's see what a acacia wood or acacia wood. Don't know. More copper ore. Another impressive sight down there. What? What? Are you following me? Is that because I put the. Uh, I feel like I'm being harassed by pigs. I am most certainly being harassed by pigs. Is it because I've got a carrot in my hand? It's because I've got a carrot in my hand, isn't it? Oh, those two piggies are now, um... Oh, there we go. Pop out came a baby piggy. Here, yeah, there we go. And there's some clay that we can climb up. Just uh, what's this? A milliard and eelgrass. Why do we have eelgrass? I put eelgrass in the water. Uh, I'll just throw that in there. No use for eelgrass right now, it just is going to take up unnecessary. Uh, the storage space, not that we are lacking storage space in any, in any way right now, but uh, yeah, no point in carrying stuff around that we're just going to end up throwing away later on anyway. Was that the lava stream? That, yeah, I think this is lava stream we saw earlier, or is it? I can't. Ah, oh, there we are. Uh, yeah, and no, I think it might be. Looks like it, yeah. Uh, let's have a quick look in our bag. Okay, so we still have two meals with us. We are still doing okay for now, but. to have a bit of a journey ahead of us. Um, oh, here's a bear. Hello, bear. Uh, I do think we need to start heading back towards uh, our home. Um, so otherwise we might run the risk of our food and health state uh, bar running out and once our food runs out we will starve to death and you've even got squids with hats kind of cool also kind of creepy creepy kind of cool So we need to, uh, I think, start heading back towards our uh, shelter. 
Um, just to cook off some of that new food as well. And make sure that we survive the night or the day, whatever it might be. 